We feel that we don't have to reinvent the wheel. There are so many people scattered all over the world who are living to be 100 and having very vibrant and very vital lives. These guys are full of vim, vigor and vitality. And so the Geriatric Society has said, let's study these people and find out what is it that keeps them so young and so healthy and so full of life. And uh, we have distilled that into our 10 pearls of longevity. I give all my patients these pearls of longevity, but these are the 10 pearls. And this is the distillation of the research modern medicine has done on how well we can stay young, healthy, vibrant, and functional if we practice these 10 pearls of longevity, which starts from a positive attitude, to good exercise, diet, and how we interact with people, we laugh a lot, how we drink, we're not dehydrated. And it's a combination of a wholesome living, the mind, body, and soul. You combine the three together so that you have a product that is you, who is vital, vibrant, and conducive to a healthful and, and good living, and you make a difference in your life. We want to spread the word uh, of, you know, this 10 pearls of longevity that Dr. Jaffer put together. Um, it is important that, um, you know, the community is aware of our philosophy and, um, you know, that the community is aware of um, those aspects um, of, you know, healthy aging that are important to us. Our blood is changed every three months. Every three months you've got new blood. The red cells born today will be dead in 90 days. <laughs> Even the bones are remodeled. That's why Dr. Margani was so right. Take care of your bones. You're remodeling them. <coughs> and finally, the only thing that's the same when she was born with are her brain cells and some of the memory cells in the blood. That's how you remember your vaccinations and so on. But otherwise, she's a new woman. When I give them this pause, <laughs> they, some of them, when they first read them, seem very simple, but as I expand on them and I emphasize how it makes a difference, they get that aha moment and say, yes, I'm going to do this. I think the pearl um, that encourages you to eat healthy, eat fruits and vegetables has definitely be made a big difference. I think that's that's been important. Dr. Jaffer is an excellent presenter. He um, portrays information in, in a great way where they understand it and he also has humor which has the seniors be able to follow, follow the information in, in a great way. This is the second time that I've come to one of his lectures and I take away so much more than I have from other people that have come to speak to us. And I think he gets to the point and he makes people uh, aware of what he's saying. Today I learned to be positive and do a good deed every day and lower the stress in my life and walk. <laughs> a lot of walking that I don't do and should do. It is better to prevent a problem than to get the problem. I'll give you an example. A stent or a bypass will not add multiple years to my life. But if my doctor told me that I'm obese, my blood pressure is out of whack, your diabetes is out of whack, and if I change any one of these criteria, I would add multiple years to my life. So prevention is much better.